cats. The internet loves them. Your aunt that owns 14 of them loves them. Lone apartment dwellers who haven't been in a relationship in like four years and are just trying to find the right person and trying to get their life on track of it. Uh, sorry, that was, uh, too real. Uh, but anyways, sailors also love cats. Cats are considered good luck. Now, the reasons, of course, should be fairly obvious at first. Cats, of course, hunt rodents, which is a huge problem aboard ships. Rats could gnaw through wood, chew through ropes, get into food stores, and even spread diseases aboard a ship. When Europeans traveled to Egypt, they were mystified by the elegance and grace of the revered companions. The Egyptians, of course, worshipped and respected the feisty felines. It didn't take long for the Europeans to adopt them as well. Cats found their way aboard ships being adopted almost like mascots for the ships. The cats were pampered and treated extremely well to keep them in good hunting shape. But it wasn't just because they were hunters. Sailors began to believe they had magical powers stored in their tail and could even control the weather. If a cat were to be thrown overboard or even fall overboard by accident, it would surely summon a storm to destroy a ship. Should the ship survive, it was nine years of bad luck. A cat's mannerisms were closely observed. If a cat were to sneeze, it meant rain. If a cat acted a bit frisky, that meant good strong winds. If they acted abnormal, like licking their fur against the grain, that meant a storm. Which is, of course, ridiculous, right? Well, maybe not so. Cats actually have incredibly sensitive inner ears. They can sense changes in air pressure, like a fuzzy little barometer. It's entirely feasible that a cat could in fact sense an approaching storm and react accordingly. Sailors would also consider it good luck if a cat approached them, and a bad omen if the cat ignored them. That might just be silly superstition, unless you believe cats are a good judge of character. Wives of sailors often kept cats at home to ensure their husbands always returned from sea. And what were the luckiest and most sought after cats by sailors? Believe it or not, black cats. Apparently going against the old bad luck for a black cat to cross your path adage. Also most prized were polydactyl cats, cats with a congenital abnormality that causes them to have more toes than normal on their paws. They were believed to be more balanced on ships and better at hunting. So next time you set to sea, smuggle your little fluffy buddy on board and watch that tail. Keep them happy and you're sure to have a fruitful voyage. Have you ever heard of this superstition? Have you ever served aboard a ship with a fluffier feathered shipmate? Let me know in the comments and stay tuned for more superstitions with the Superstitious Sailor. Fair winds and following seas, shipmates.